we all know that the city of Deltona, for the most part, is 80% rooftop. But as we continue to evolve and grow, uh, we're seeing a lot of businesses coming into the area. Um, if we look at the north side off of Holland Boulevard, where we have the hospital, we have Amazon, there's other adventures that are coming right. into that area. Um, and But one of the things that I want to talk about, and by the way, um, we've made it to Florida Trend. Uh, this month's Florida Trend, um, there's actually a nice spread from page 44 to about 54 Look at that. that talks about the uh, Great Daytona region and Volusia County, and it talks about Deltona. That's it awesome. talks about our trails, it talks about Amazon, it talks about all the op opportunities they have with the land available that we have yeah. off of I-4, which I think is key to everything. It so is. a lot of people say, well, how did you land Amazon? Well, I, I think it was a blessing. We're right off of I-4. Um, so if you really look at it from the property itself to get to I-4, it's probably less than a mile. The proximity was key, yes. yeah. It's the same thing with the hospital, with Halifax yeah. UF Health. It's right off the highway. Um, so I think those opportunities, we're starting to, to develop those opportunities. That being said, you know, one of the other challenges that we always have here for our residents, they talk about, well, where are the restaurants? Where are the businesses? You know, we have to travel to Orange City. Um, so I brought this, and, and speaking to our city manager, because um, this is a very good illustration. So you might not see it well, um, but I know David is going to be able to put it up. But you're going to see a cluster of businesses up here. Well, that cluster of businesses is in Orange City. The key there is that they have sewer. Yeah. You're going to see a very line here with no, and then we have another cluster here in Deltona, which again, there's sewer there. So one of the challenges that we have in, in reference to bringing in the development and the businesses is utilities. Um, I know with our CM, we're working off of that Saxon um, Boulevard to create utilities so that we can then bring in the restaurants and the businesses, which is very important here to the city of Deltona. Um, so again, I want to clarify, this is not about forcing people into sewer. This is about providing opportunities to, to get sewer available so that we can have businesses here in the city. Uh, well, I know when you showed me this earlier, I didn't realize it either. And I know I've heard people you know, say, when is shopping coming? When are restaurants coming? This makes sense. And I think a lot of people, the general public, don't realize what the holdup is. And seeing a map like this, I think will really explain it to you. Because obviously a big business can't come in and have a septic tank. Exactly. And um, so this is well, a wonderful layout. And, and one of the other things uh, as well, when we talk about restaurants and things like that, you know, restaurants do the bulk of their money during lunch. Yeah. So if we don't have a lunch crowd, it's very right. difficult for any business to yeah. come here. So if you notice, yes, we've had some fast food restaurants, especially off of I-4, around the hospital, around Amazon. Again, because it provides somewhat of a lunch crowd. But as we continue to work with Saxon Boulevard and continue to work in providing utilities in these areas, I think you're going to see Deltona starting to emerge again in yeah. that business aspect of it.